Hello YouTube. Old Money 74 here. Thought I'd shoot a video this afternoon. Actually reshooting a video. Uh, I made one of these before. It didn't turn out exactly like I wanted. <clears throat> what I want to talk about was someone everybody in the gun world knows as Bubba. Now Bubba is known for just really messing up a good gun. <clears throat> Sometimes Bubba can do you a very big favor. What we have right here is a Remington 700 with a Nikon Buckmaster Mill Dot Scope tripod, sling, shell, shell holder. Now, I was shopping around for a 30 out 6 called a uh, pawn shop in town they said they had one but Bubba had gotten to it make me a good deal on it so I went down there and they had this beautiful <laughs> absolutely immaculate Remington 700 only it had been spray painted by Bubba well after some wheeling and dealing I got this gun for $300 folks that scope's about $300. The gun, after I took it apart and cleaned it, I noticed that it just hardly ever been shot. It's just in immaculate condition. Except for being spray painted. Uh, there's the first case where Bubba did me a favor. I've got another one right here. Everybody recognizes this. This is a Remington 870 12 gauge. Now this is a nice gun. Let me show you some. Here locally we have a a uh, gun shop that does uh, porting and custom chokes and all that. This gun set up to be a turkey gun and. Uh, when I bought it, I noticed it had some custom chokes in it. This is a 660 turkey choke right here. And uh, after uh, taking a trip down to the gunsmith here locally who, who does this work, makes these chokes, does all the barrel work, showed it to him. He said, yeah, that's one of mine. Uh, come to find out, this gun's had about $500 worth of barrel work done to it. This chokes like 90 bucks. Well, same situation as with the 700. Called the pawn shop, see what they had. Had this 870 pump shotgun Bubba got to. And Bubba did get to it. That's uh, not a professional camo job, you see there. I got down there and looked at it. I offered him $150 for it and he took it. And then uh, did a little research on the barrel and the choke and sure enough, a bunch of custom work done to it. So there again, Bubba did me a big favor. So just as a note to all you gun guys out there that visit the pawn shops, you know, it pays sometimes to look off in the corner where they've got the ugly stuff because there's some good stuff sitting over there you may just get lucky in this case I got lucky twice and that's four hundred fifty dollars for a damn nice seven hundred scope and an eight seventy with a barrel job it's old money seventy four signing out